Hi, this is Sandy Joe from RhinestoneTemplates.com, and I'm going to be doing some short little videos here on WinPC uh, Pro 2010 just to give you guys an idea of the um, different things. But first, I wanted to mention that I um, had done the update here that we all have been concerned with, and I had just done a modifier repair, and I was having some issues with the, the WinPC crashing and different things, and I wasn't able to use the fit tool. It was just coming in with one size stone like a center line instead of uh, the actual fit. So that's what we're going to cover right now, and what I did is I actually uninstalled my whole program went through the back of my computer and I uninstalled the whole program, reinstalled, and then did the update that comes up. But um, I would like to go ahead and show you one of the, the features of the new things of the 2012 WinPC. And um, we're just gonna, I'm going to go ahead in and I'm going to grab the Edwardian script. And the reason I'm grabbing Edwardian script is um, I want a font, whoops, I better type that a little bit different. Um, I want a font that has skinny lines and has thick lines. And when we try to get our, our fit um, for the, the stones with different, like say a, a 6SS and a, a 16, we want something that has a skinny line here and then has a really thick line in here so it can actually, the thicker line is going to have the bigger stones to follow it and the skinny line is going to have the smaller stones. So I just typed out on the Edwardian script that comes with our, our software, I typed out love and I have this at the size of about 3.6.6 uh, wide inches and 3 inches high. And I'm going to go ahead and bring up on the bottom of our toolbar, our little gem that brings up our transformation bar. And um, I'm going to go ahead and hit my um, fit which is the set SS and hit that and I am going to make sure that I have my 9 SS clicked for my my 6 SS and I have 14 SS for 10 SS and I have 19 SS for um, the 16 SS so I have that done and as long as that's clicked you just hit apply and you let it just go ahead and work and do its thing and it'll take a little bit of time and what it's doing is it's taking and searching where those skinny little lines are and putting the smaller stones on and then it's where the thicker lines are are going to be where the bigger stones are and you can see it's all done it leaves the original image in the background so if you wanted to adjust any stones at this point you could and like here this will need an extra one right there and that actually was the 14 SS stone you'll want to just duplicate it but you can see I have bigger ones in here which will be my 16 SS stones. These will be my 10 SS stones, then my little ones are my 6 SS. So you can see how that actually looks. I would move that around a little bit. I'm going to take that out. I'm going to go ahead and I can see I would have put one there, one down in there. And I'm going to go ahead and bring up my color palette and I'm going to click off of the outline that you saw in the yellow and then I'm just going to change it to a red color so you can see it really well and you can see all the different sizes of the stones and they're really easy but um, that's how you work with your fit stones if this does not work in the program that means that your update was not complete and that's how I realized I needed to actually um, uninstall my update and do that so um, that's just one of the things in the 2012 and if I can help you with anything else just let me know